everybody and welcome back to our channel where the movie couple i'm wendy i'm dustin and say hello to our new tv i was about to say say hello to my little friend but this guy ain't little he's this a is, big boy i mean i'm five one mm -hmm. and i know this is just the box but like if i laid across the front this yeah this is about wendy size <laughs> Toshiba, if you need any sort of measurement, you can start calling your, <laughs> your new large TVs Wendy size. So this is, as you can see, the Toshiba 65M55 TV. This is a part of Toshiba's M550 KU flagship series. It has Fire TV built in, which means it can give you a whole smart home experience. And it has 4K technology, Dolby Atmos, Dolby Vision, and bezel-less full screen design. Can I just say I'm super excited for the bezel-free full screen design, which means to me, I mean, we're going to see it in the box, but you can kind of see it here. It's essentially edge to edge, which is very exciting. The size of the TV, in case you couldn't tell by the name of it, it is 65 <laughs> inches, which is a huge upgrade. Uh, from our previous TV, which was a 40... 46. 46 inch TV that we've had since before we were married. So that's like probably about a 10 year old TV mm -hmm. that we've never upgraded. It's actually fallen over once. One of the legs just decided to break one day and luckily I was sitting near it so I was able to catch it. And luckily that TV was on skate. But you guys know here on the Movie Couple channel how often we do reactions how often we talk about, you know, especially since we're staying home a lot, um, watching movies, watching some of our TV show, favorite TV shows at home, and I think we just upped our game. Now they're going to look so much better. 4K, baby. So I think um, let's go ahead and unbox this. There are tons of features that comes with this TV that I really want to dive into before we get into the unboxing, before we get into our review, and how some of our favorite shows look on this TV. So I'm going to go ahead and put it up on the screen for you right now. So because this comes with built-in Fire TV, it's going to give you endless content options. You've got your Prime Video, you've got your Netflix, YouTube, Disney+, Plus, where all of our favorite shows live, like Moon Knight, the upcoming Obi-Wan, Miss Marvel, and so much more, and of course, Hulu. There's also live view picture in picture, which allows us to see a live feed of our compatible video doorbell or security cameras right on the screen, which is super convenient. There is Alexa that you can use and you can ask her to manage your TV power, volume, playback, and so much more. And with that, it does come with built-in microphones so we can use our voice to access what we want to watch without ever touching the remote because half the time we can't find it anyways. So we can launch apps, we can search for titles, we can play music, we can switch input, important, and we can control our smart home devices right here from the TV. And earlier I was talking about the 4K, so this does have the Regza Engine 4K, enhances 4K resolution color and contrast with Ultra Essential PQ technology and Dolby Vision HDR. So this is the first Fire TV with local dimming in up to 48 zones for color adjustment in dark environments. Also important when you are watching movies at home. So I know that was a lot of information. I'm gonna go ahead and list those in the video description as well so you can take your time to read it and as well as a link to the product. And with that, I am sure you're itching to like Oh the yeah. This. Now I know we have to be careful because there is a special way to actually open this. And the, it's on the top. What? It says open it this way, not this way. That's no, a box set and ready. I think this is what Dustin was talking about just now with um, mm -hmm. opening it the right way. So we're going to try to figure that out right now. Okay, so we don't carefully. touch the front. Don't touch the front. Don't the back. Uh, we'll the there we go. This is still really big. <laughs> Wait. Like this is this is still pretty much windy sized. Yep. Whoa. So pretty. So we're going to go ahead and put the legs on. So we've got the TV set up, as you saw, and this is now we're in our natural habit. Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> I always have a pillow behind me. 
Okay, now we are in our natural habitat when we are normally doing our reactions for, you know, for any of the Disney Plus shows or whatever, maybe Cobra Kai. So mm -hmm. we're going to turn the TV on for the first time and like react to our TV turning on because it's big and beautiful. <laughs> so let's go ahead and take a look. Here we go. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, it says Dolby Vision on it. That's a, that's actually a really that's that's a really dark. Black. That's a dark black. That's, that's like, like a black black. Like in Dolby in the in movie in the, yeah. in the movie theater, they're like the projector is still on. <laughs> you for a second, I really could not tell that it was on. Yo, that is beautiful. Ooh. That's a really fire good, TV. That's a really good picture. Ooh. Oh, setup okay. Time. So we're gonna go through the setup real quick. Bear with us. So I think one of the best things to do to test out this TV is to watch the latest trailer uh, from uh, James Cameron himself, Avatar: The Way of Water. Here we go. I have to admit, the sound's pretty good without a sound bar or anything. Yeah, we're testing the TV, you know, to its full potential. So we're we, we're using just the sound from the TV itself. Mm -hmm. That's a really good shot. I mean, Ooh. that is that's a oh, whole very crisp, I very like vibrant it. color. But that the picture looks yeah, so picture good looks on that. Yeah, the picture looks fantastic. And we also saw wow. it in 3D. We saw it in 3D, but this is this is looking pretty good on our TV here. Are we not going to have to go to the theaters? Every <laughs> we just changed our whole at-home viewing experience with this, this new TV. Oh, wow. I felt like this was a good trailer to kind of test it out. Like, you know, one, it's one of the newer things that's out. Uh, and we've only really technically seen it twice. Once... Both in theaters, once at the like 3D thing that we got invited to, mm -hmm. which is just a trailer but with 3D glasses on and an IMAX, and then the second time at Doctor Strange, but it was no 3D, just 2D. Yeah. But IMAX. And I have to admit, this TV guys... holds up. I mean, I really like one one thing that's very important in a TV like this too is to be able to get that really black black in the yes. background because then you can get some really good definition of the picture and it just looked beautiful there are some shots in there that i'm like it looks just as good as it does on a big screen yeah and obviously you guys know our older tv is a much smaller much more dated uh in tech and everything and this one's got a lot of bells and whistles it's got wi-fi built in it's got fire tv it was really kind of easy to just you know download like an app and, and sign in. I will say, and this part may be kind of the Wi-Fi on our part um, because our, because of our modem, we're not sure, but we did have some hiccups trying to, it kept on saying it was disconnecting from the Wi-Fi, but then the next second it would connect. Uh, and it, so in the beginning it did just kind of kept us, kept kicking us into the previous screen where it's telling you you have to check your Wi-Fi, but it seems to be of no issue now so I'm excited, you know, we get to have just on one thing without having to turn on yeah. different inputs. <laughs> what we used to do is we had our Xbox, our Switch, and our PlayStation. We were using our Xbox and PlayStation to watch various things. So it's like we have to switch to this input to watch Netflix and switch to that input to watch Hulu. And it was... A little annoying. Yeah, to be able to switch back and forth. Now I have everything all in one place on a beautiful screen. And we also don't really need a sound bar, our old sound bar sound, anymore. Sounds really it sounds good. just as good as it did without the yeah. sound, uh, with the sound bar on our old TV. So I'm hooked. I love this setup. I love this TV. It looks beautiful. Thank you so much. Yeah, thanks Toshiba for sending this over for us to test out and review. From now on, reacting to Disney Plus shows, the upcoming Obi-Wan, it's going to be a very different experience for us and I'm very excited. You know, I don't think watching one thing is good enough. Let's watch episode 6 of Moon Knight. What's convenient, there's a Disney Plus button, <laughs> there's a Hulu button, there's a Netflix button, and a Prime Video. It's, it's the four that we watch the most. Yep, yep. Perfect. All right, here we go. <laughs> Oh, wow, that looks so good. There's details on their faces that I'm not picking up from before. From our, from our puny old TV? Uh-huh. 
Oh my god, we get to watch rewatch the costume transformation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That looks really good. Dude, it good, looks so though. good on this TV. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The details now on that look so good. Oh. You know how our reaction could have been so much more different uh -huh. if we were watching it on this TV, all those six episodes? I can't wait to see Obi-Wan on this TV. Oh, Whoa. I know. How aren't you? I knew you'd miss me. Layla turned you down, didn't she? The pictures are <laughs> so good. I was not strong enough to stop her. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> Oh my god, we've been missing out yeah, this entire time really, it's like you with don't, our old TV. You don't know what you're missing until you're shown the light, so to speak. Let's go. I wanted the, the epic shot of them over the moon. Mm -hmm. There right it here. is. Need it a fix. <laughs> it's so detailed. Double punch. <laughs> Yeah, we've been missing out. I'm kind of mad. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm happy. I'm happy that now, you know, moving forward for all of our reactions for Disney Plus shows, like sitting out here on the couch, it's going to be a little bit different. Yeah. Like Koba Kai is going to look really good. Obi-Wan's going to look fantastic. Oh, Obi-Wan. So excited. Go. And that is our review on the Toshiba 65 inch. And 550 Fire TV. I've never had a Fire TV before. No. Uh, so this is, this is, I feel like I just got a, we just got a major upgrade. <laughs> and I am going to be a, literally a couch potato for the next few months. I'm a potato. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching and we will see you in the next video. Bye. Right. Am I tall enough to do this? Yeah, then I think we pull. I'm not tall enough to do this. Huh. Oh, my hands oh, stuck in it. Wait, 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 wait.